caught not Tiffany Haddish going after Jennifer Hudson for stealing Common from her? It's been almost three years since Tiffany Haddish and Common broke up, and he's been dating Jennifer for about a year now. But Tiffany is still holding a major grudge because from blaming Common for dropping her, she is also now blaming Jennifer for her failed relationship. Not only that, but she seems to believe that Jennifer actively went after Common and that's why he ended things with Tiffany. So it looks like Tiffany is still super salty over the fact that she got dumped by Common and to make matters worse, he wasted no time to move on with someone new. For those who might not be aware, Common's breakup with Tiffany Haddish was kind of messy and they gave different accounts of what led to their breakup. But one thing that was super clear is that Tiffany didn't want to break up because she claimed that the breakup wasn't mutual and he blindsided her with the news of their breakup. Common and Tiffany met in 2019 while working on the movie The Kitchen and there was great chemistry between them. But Common randomly decided to go after his ex, Angela Rye, and when things didn't work out between them, he went running back to Tiffany, who was more than happy to take him back. Now, we all know Common has a problem with staying committed. So when he went back to Tiffany, he did the whole thing where he swore that he was going to be a great partner because he had gone to therapy and was looking to settle down with the right woman. Have a, a rather famous relationship coach. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah that, yes, uh, Michelle Obama. She is definitely helped talk me through just certain moments of relationships. We had conversations and she has given me a lot of wisdom. But one great thing that, that she told me as I was going through this journey was that you have to understand you're not gonna get anybody that's perfect because you're not perfect. So understand that there's some certain things that you will compromise in, in, in choosing that partner. But long, as long as the, the core values, the values that are most important to you, that person you know, marks off on that list, then you good. She gave some good advice there. That's good wisdom. She does right? some really good wisdom there. Yeah. And for a while, people believed that he meant his words and that Tiffany was the right woman for him. I mean, they looked cute together, but it didn't take long for people to realize that the relationship seemed like a one-way thing because Tiffany seemed way more emotionally invested in the relationship than he was because my man's was doing the bare minimum. Like the time she hinted that she wanted a big thing for her 41st birthday. She said, I'm just hoping me and my man, we going hot air ballooning and having us a nice little meal. That's what I would like to do. On my 39th birthday, I got drunk with my grandma. Never done that before. And my 40th birthday, I had a bat mitzvah and that was super fun. This birthday, 41, I wanna go up in a hot air balloon. Well, Common was not about to put in that much effort, so he just got her some flowers and called it a day. But Tiffany wasn't bothered because she then revealed that she wanted him to propose to her with an apartment building. If he wanna marry me, he can get me an apartment building. Oh, okay. No, okay. You don't want a ring, you want an apartment complex. <laughs> I'd give me a duplex, an eightplex or something. You know, you know the homegirls be like, where your ring? I thought you was engaged, where your ring? Where your carrots? Carrots. Girl, please, I got units. And if you're wondering what Common had to say about that, well, he basically said that he wasn't even thinking about proposing to her at all. Do what's good for, for me and the lady, <laughs> you know. Right now, all I want is happiness, good times, um, peace on earth. <laughs> Tiffany also talked about how she wanted to have kids and revealed that she was ready to adopt kids. She said, I'm taking parenting classes now to adopt. I'm looking at, you know, five and up, really like seven. I want them to be able to know how to use the restroom on their own and talk. I want them to know that I put in the work and I wanted them. She then claimed that she was ready to have kids of her own with Common, even though they weren't actively planning to. She said, and if that did happen, we're gonna hire some help, then we're gonna cry a lot. And I'm not gonna be baby mama, I'm gonna be wife. But the thing is, Common has made it clear over the years that he isn't sure about having kids, so it was weird that Tiffany was talking about having kids. To nobody's surprise, they ended up breaking up not long after that, and Common tried to give the whole Hollywood excuse of having busy schedules. It, it really didn't allow for us to spend as much time and put as much energy into our relationship. I don't think the love really dispersed. I just think it was just like, we weren't feeding the relationship. Well, Tiffany was not about to let Common get away with that lie, so she told her own side of the story. She said, he might be the type of person that never really settles with somebody. Maybe he's like, you know, like a bee going from flower to flower to flower. I don't know. I wish him nothing but joy and happiness. After the breakup, Common started dating Jennifer Hudson, 
And for a while, they tried to keep the relationship under wraps. Things between them got heated in 2022 when they both worked on the movie Breathe. At the time, inside sources revealed that they've known each other for years. Things took a romantic turn while they were filming in Philadelphia over the summer. When the day's shoot wrapped, they always found their way back to each other's side. At first, Jennifer tried to deny the dating rumors, saying, people create their narratives of it. We shot a film together and he played my husband. We gotta eat in between those moments. But then they were spotted on a date in Malibu after the movie finished filming and the rumors got stronger. Their relationship became kind of official when he flew to London to show support for her musical, A Strange Loop. Well, Tiffany did not take news of this relationship well and has even thrown direct jabs at Jennifer on social media. Girl, he never gave me no damn earrings. He probably gave those to Jennifer. Yeah, that was just completely unnecessary, but Tiffany didn't stop there because she has been obsessing over her relationship with Common and how he did her dirty. In a recent interview, she said, it was the healthiest, the funnest relationship I've ever had. It's where I felt safest out of all the relationships I ever had. The breakup wasn't mutual. It was more him saying, I think this relationship has run its course. And I was like, okay, like you gonna be a 50 year old single man, okay? Child, can you imagine that you move on from your relationship with a new boo, but your ex is still out here talking about you and giving interviews? That's gotta be awkward. Anyway, things got heated once again when Common and Jennifer officially confirmed their relationship. He was a guest on her talk show and she asked him this. Are you dating anyone? <laughs> so, yes. And I'm in a relationship that is one of the most beautiful people I ever met in life. And she's, she's smart, she loves God, she has something real down to earth about her. Um, she's talented, but, but I, set, I set my standard kind of high because she had to have an E God. She, 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 she had to win an Oscar on her first movie. I set my standard high, she had to get her own talk show. Oh, okay. Yeah, so. I'm not gonna lie, that was kind of cute. But what really sealed it up was this cute selfie that they posted after, cause it has all the girlies gagged and rooting for them. But y'all wanna know who isn't rooting for them? Tiffany, that's who. See, according to sources, Tiffany is still not over Common, even though it has been about two years since the breakup. And according to an insider, she still held on to hope that she and Common might get back together. But now that he is dating Jennifer, she feels broken and is starting to give up hope of getting back together with him. The insider went on to add that Tiffany believes that Jennifer pressured Common into the relationship and that's the reason that Common went after Jennifer instead of coming back to her and fixing things. But unfortunately for her, fans are slamming her for being Delulu and they left Common saying, you need to stop, you're in enough trouble. Tiffany, stop the media trauma, don't disrespect your black sister, move on and make money. Jennifer Hudson is Virgo like Beyonce, which means she's unbothered, will ignore Tiffany, act like she doesn't exist, and ain't responded to Tiffany's shade and foolishness. And Jennifer didn't steal her man, they were already broken up. Tiffany is a hot mess as usual, but I wanna know what you guys think about this. Do you believe that Jennifer really stole Common away from Tiffany, or do you think that she's trying to stir up some drama as usual? Drop your thoughts in the comments below, and then check out this next video.